My father started a bungalow colony, so he'd have to make some extra money. Um, and my father, my grandfather started a rooming house. Eine von die Mädelach in meinen Klass ist gewinnen Chava Rappaport, Malkali Rappaport's Tochter. Und mir sind ein Gewinn Freund. Und die Mom ist gekommen mit mir, mir genommen ein Bungalow in Malkali Rappaport's Bungalow Colony, Lee Ra Colony. Und dort ist gewinnen sehr gut. Es ist gewinnen uh, jüdische Menschen und ein Sachschreiber. There were 16 cottages, which were very, not, nothing fancy. They were like maybe a small room with a little bedroom off it. Um, but all my cousins came up there as well. And I spent every summer there till I was about 12. It was kind of, um, everybody had their own little kochalain, you know, kind of thing. You cooked and you, and only two rooms. It was very simple. Um, we used to walk through the forest to go to the creek because who thought of swimming pools? That that came much later. I mean, in the middle of everything, you know, my father used to also work in the city, and then he'd come out and you know he'd fix all. He he was a mechanic, uh, and and my mother used to characterize herself. She had a dual kind of identity, and she has a poem about it. Uh, I am a Cinderella, and she describes washing the toilets in the bungalow colony, which she used to do every spring. Um, you know, they had to prepare the facilities for the guests. And, you know, she had somebody to help her clean, but it wasn't sufficient. She had to do that also. And she worked very hard in that. She managed the bungalow colony. But I grew up kind of in a funny kind of situation. If I go to a bungalow, my mother would say, go to Licht's bungalow, go to Lesson's bungalow, go to Khan's bungalow. And I realized later they were Schreiber, <laughs> and they used to come out and be there. I, I seem to recall people reading the Yiddish newspapers there all the time. I, I believe I met Gladstein there. The poet and artist, the Lichts, were there. She's given dort, I think Ruven Iceland is given a Schreiber, Rolnick is given a Schreiber, dort, they genommen bungalows dort, in Van Summe. Und dann noch auf den Schabes und Sonntag kommen noch Schreiber. Some that I remember is Michael Licht, Leon Kobrin, Lesson's first name, I don't know, because he was always Lesson. They, they called people a lot by their last names, like my father was always Rappaport. Rappaport or Archie, you know, they call him that too. People who, I don't remember their names, but I was always told, well, they're famous, but, you know, <laughs> I'm not sure. Maybe they, they did, definitely had stature in that, um, in that world. When Jens Schab is by Nacht, haben sie sich zusammelt. Und gelehen sie ihre Poemes. Sie ist gewöhnt sehr schön. Ich gedenke sehr gut. Um, und danach haben sie gehabt Essen und Tanzen und Musik. Und sie ist gewöhnt eine freiliche Zeit. So their bungalows were designated. And they still had their name long after they were gone. <laughs> and they were still designated by their names. And even to this day, I'd say, I, I know exactly what Lessons Bungalow looks like. For me, it was... It seemed huge. I've been back there, it's nothing. Um, but for kids, we had freedom there. I, as a kid, kind of benefited from this communal nature of things. Probably that's what rescued me as a thinker. You know, you can't supervise people who sleep in bungalows, you know. When the parents get together, they'll sneak out anyway. And I had a lot of years I've been there before. Und habe Rapport mein Freund ist gewinnt dort und es ist gewinnt gut.